Hi everyone, welcome back. This is Elsa the Bargain Hunter here. I'm sorry guys if I seem to be a little off. <clears throat> um, my back is acting up for some reason all of a sudden. My last video was fine, but now it's like acting up, so I'm a little I'm in a little pain, but I wanted to get this done and show you guys what I grabbed at Dollar General. So I went over to Dollar General with my daughter to grab some um, necessities. And um, they still had a lot of Christmas stuff left. And what I'm planning to do, because the stuff has been marked down to 10 cents now. And I'm pretty much set. I don't I don't need anything. But I'm planning to go uh, maybe tomorrow and grab whatever I can for 10 cents. And um, it's a benefit having the basement. And what I wanted to do is box everything that I get and um, get it over when the time comes, get it over to the shelter or a uh, women's center, you know, family, women and family centers. Um, my son's mother-in-law works at, uh, <coughs> excuse me, at a shelter. And usually when I grab penny items at Dollar General, um, I take what I need from what I've hauled on the on penny items. And then I give the rest to her whenever I dispose of any clothing I give it to her um, with the with the massive weight loss that I've had I've had to redo my wardrobe and all my clothes and it was a lot I gave it all to her it's usually what I do I don't like taking it to Goodwill um because they'll they'll go ahead and sell it and yeah it's at a good price but I just I just don't feel comfortable when there's so many people out there that need stuff you know so what I'm planning to do because they still had a good amount of stuff left uh, Christmas cards, stockings. I'm going to focus on the Christmas cards and stockings. And um, maybe some wreaths. I didn't notice if they had any wreaths. But the tissue paper and wreaths. I'm going to focus on those things. I figured $10. I mean $10. Uh, $4 would give me at least 40 items. And that should clear what they have. I, I'm going to go tomorrow. Yeah, I'm going to check out what they have left. They had a good amount today. But um, I'm going to check it out tomorrow. I'll take about 4 or $5 with me and just grab what they have. Put it in a big cardboard box and just store it for when the time comes. Come Christmas next year. I'll make, I don't want to give it to her now because she doesn't have the space to save it. And I don't know if the shelter does. And, you know, I like to give it to them when they need it. Uh, was it last year, I think? I think it was last year or the year before. I hauled a bunch of planners, um, calendars pocket planners and I gave them all to her. It was over a hundred pocket planners and assortments and stuff. And um I gave them all to her. I took what I needed. I had the desktop calendar. I had a pocket calendar. Uh the wall calendar and then I gave a set to my daughter and one to my daughter in law. And then I still had over a hundred left. And I paid a penny for each. And um I just gave them all to her and she said that would came in handy for the fathers in the center that have um, doctor's appointments, interviews, stuff like that. So I want to do the same thing with the Christmas stuff and I'm just going to grab it now. At least four or five dollars worth, whatever they have left. I just want to grab it now and just um, store it downstairs and come Christmas time, all these families will have Christmas cards, stockings for their kids, you know, whatever it takes. I mean, these people, they're in a situation and they either don't have family don't have funds and that's what i do i mean part of my bargain hunting came from that um i always grab excess i did it mostly for the family because we're, we're a large family i have seven sisters alone and um when i grab stuff on clearance i mean i've been doing the back to school stuff and loading cardboard boxes of stuff and my nieces and nephews after my kids grabbed their supplies, I would call my nieces and my sisters at the time because my nieces and nephew were young. I would call them and say, have so-and-so or come with so-and-so. Um, do you have your school supply list? Back then, they didn't really do the school supplies list, but, you know, we had an idea of what they wanted. And they would stock up on notebooks, highlighters, pencils, um, not backpacks because they can be expensive, but, you know, pencil cases. I did all that. I started my bargain hunting as a single mom and, and then I started helping my nieces and nephews and now they're all old enough. I try to grab stuff for their kids, my my little nieces and nephews. 
so we just take it from there but um stuff like christmas and stuff i'm gonna i'm gonna see what i can do tomorrow i'll probably have a haul for you guys tomorrow after the house clears because i'm having my sunday dinner tomorrow so we'll see um let me just show you guys really quick what i got i did find one item that i was interested in finding for myself and that was the red tablecloth this was 10 cents i'm just going to put this on top of my craft table i want to have extras in case the other one burns i did grab a green one so i did grab this one tablecloth for 10 cents everything else was regular price and it's just because i haven't finished my loaded valentine bag and i just needed to in my pocket letters and stuff so i wanted to add to that so i grabbed the box of the sweet tarts a five pack these are also a dollar just as like at um dollar tree <coughs> I grabbed the pack of the Brax Tiny Conversation Hearts. Grab the pack of that. Um, I don't know if I grab these for the bag or for myself because I love these. And this is Smarties. Big old pack of Smarties. It says Valentine's on it. So I thought that was cute. These are two dollars, but it's a big bag. And I found these two cute. There's only ten. Is it ten count in here? And it's the Love Beads candy bracelets. And it has the to and from on the bag. And there's a 10 count. And these are only a dollar. I thought that was cute. So that's the candy that I grabbed. Um, I did need, because I kept forgetting to grab them, was the um, four count of the heart picks. These, I love these. So I got a pack of the red ones and the pink ones. I didn't realize how cute they were. Pink ones are really cute. So I grabbed one of each for a dollar. Um, I grabbed this three pack of bath fizzers. And they're cute. One says kiss me. The other one says I love you. And the other one says XOXO. So I grabbed that. And this was three dollars. So a dollar each. Not bad. I grabbed that. And um, I thought this was really cute. If <laughs> only a dollar, I thought that was really, really cute. It's the solar heart flower. Isn't that cute? I like that. So I got that one. We have this two pack of kitchen towels. These were three dollars, so a dollar fifty each. And the front one in the front says "Kisses, Love, Life, Laugh, Celebrate." I think that's all that one says. Yeah, that's that one. I thought it was super cute. And then this one is really cute. This one says, oh, sorry. It says the secret ingredient is always love. And it has, oh, it has the mason jar on it. I thought that was really cute. So the two for three dollars, so a dollar fifty each. And last but not least, now my shoulder wants to act up. Oh. Is this cute little monkey? I like the pink on it. <laughs> so I believe she was a dollar. Yeah, she was a dollar. So I got her. I thought that was cute. So that is pretty much it. Um, I'm gonna have to work on some pain medication. But yeah, guys. Um. I might be back tomorrow. Let's see what happens if I go out and head over to back to Dollar General and grab some stuff to store downstairs for for the needy families come Christmas. I can do the Christmas card stockings and whatever else. We'll see. We'll see what else they have. They did have a lot of the um, solar powered. These, they have elves and stuff. You know, the Christmas ones, but they had the elves. Santa Claus. I might just grab those. Those will be fun for the kids. We'll see. All right, guys. Back to my uh, real life over here and pain and all. I gotta clean, cook dinner, and make it happen. Sorry, guys. I'm in severe pain right now. But I will talk to you guys later. Stay blessed. Bye.